If you want to test your creativity, just flexing your muscles, here is something for you to do. I will just help you with some tips. But if our lazy Don't think I'm lazy. I am busy. Oh, sorry. If you are busy, there is a link in the description for you to download this template video for free. So in this video, we are going to edit this paid lower third and make it better. Not only that, but we also want to make it free. Now I know that you may be having a valid subscription for all effects, but just appreciate this video on behalf of our friends who may not have the effects subscription at the moment. Now for those who want to exercise their creativity, here are some tips for you to create these shapes. Now you take a white image like this. Double click and go mask. Here is the first option, as you can see on all our mask shapes, we don't have this kind of a shape, so you could import it if you have it in your computer or download it online. The second option is to use pen tool, so that you can draw your custom mask shape. Drag down your preview window and maximize it so that you can have a closer look. So this method could be difficult on the round edges, so you have to be very careful. So if you found it difficult to create this shape, just use the one I have created for you. So let us drag it into the timeline and start from here and go ahead to perfect our lower third. So now let's create this middle part. Drag down the image. Double click and go mask, choose pen tool. Maximize your preview window. When you are done, press OK. Go transition and look for erase. Drag it to this image on both ends. For a nice animation, add a keyframe. You can remove the transition to see it right. Then from the preview window, move this image like this. Then bring back the transition. Now the next thing, you can add a logo. I will add this Filmora logo here. Make it of perfect size add a dissolve transition for a better appearance. Then add it again on to the end. Well, are you guys enjoying this video so far? If yes, just reach your finger to that subscribing button to stay ready for the next cool tutorials. Now we can add an image also. Go effects and add the image mask. Customize the size. Now we have our nice circle image, let's add an animation on it. Double click, go animation, and go legacy motions. Then choose boom. OK. Now let's go to this last and interesting part of adding text. So you just keep watching and I will show you the actual preview just now. Add a default text by clicking this button here. Now count 7 frames from the starting point of the middle image. Let the text start from there. Go advance for this text. In the first text box, write the name and change your font to a better bold one. I will choose Monster Rate Black and set the color to this one. In the second text, I will write Content Creator. Set the text color back to white and monster rate light italic for a text.
For the animation set first text on this to the right. And set the second text to the left animation. The disable the in animation of this second text. Let's render and check it out. Okay so before the final preview, let's remove that green screen on our lower third video. Double click and go AI tool. Go chroma key, then turn it on. Are you happy now? No! You only know lower thirds! What about some text effects? Okay, just click this video right here.